Hi everybody at home, I'm here with Ashley Borden and he, she is our new academic assistant coach for this year. Hi Ashley, thank you Hi for being there. with us. Thank you so for me. basically just tell us what your job title is, what you hope okay. to accomplish this year and go okay, ahead. Well I'm new to Dana Health, to this position is brand new. Um, I'm basically kind of like an academic advisor and I'm also more of a support system for the entire football program. I'm going to be helping out the students that have the below GPA level. Uh, making sure we, we don't have as many this year, you know, making sure we're working on their grades, keeping their grades up. Um, I'm going to be also there for the students that want to go on to college and maybe play football, make sure that they know the NCAA requirements, um, help them out with the just the plain, you know, CSU and Cal State and, and UC requirements as well. And um, basically just be an on-campus on um, support for the boys and uh, just be an academic, make academics more of more a bigger a bigger more important part of their career at, at Dana Health or for your career. So what do you plan on doing for each of the boys on an individual basis? Individually I want to try to set up um, some sort of a plan with each one individually where they want to go what they want to accomplish. Um, we'll look at their transcript um, if they're a current student at Dana Hills if they're an incoming student you know we'll set up a four-year plan for them. I want to make sure that we are keeping everyone on track I, I think that it's really important to recognize our scholar athletes, um, do something, make that more um, celebrated so that it's more of an, uh, something that they ins are inspired to do. Um, I think that grades are very important for these boys. It's going to make or break whether they're able to go on and play. You can be the best player, but if you don't have the grades for it, they're not going to be able to get into college with it. So um, I think that's really important. I really want to make sure that uh, we have like a tutoring session you know, going on regularly with the students that need it. Um, we can set up tutoring where the, some of the players maybe that have the better grades and are able to balance everything really well can help out some of the players that are maybe finding, finding it a little bit more difficult. Um, we'll do a, ta a study table before school sessions, uh, probably I think three days a week, and that'll be good for some of the students that maybe aren't, aren't get, keeping their grades up. So individually, I think if we just set up plans and have like a goal set and have a way to accomplish it, I think it'll be great for all the boys. Do you have any experience before this of anything helping out? I'm actually in the process of getting my teaching credential right now. Um, I've coached cheer and song uh, for five years now, and I'm still currently doing that at a different high school. And uh, my mom is the ac head academic advisor here at Dana Hills, so um, I have a lot of support from her. I'm learning a lot from her every day. I feel like I'm learning something new, and I feel like that's really helpful. So Good. And what do you plan on teaching? I want to teach high school math. so. Hopefully next year I'll be doing that. Hopefully. Do you have an interning or anything that you're doing right now? Not yet. I'm a substitute teach. So I hear you have a little bit of a football background. Do you want to explain that for us? I do. Um, well, I'm an alumni from Dana Hills, and I was a cheerleader and a song leader at Dana Hills for four years. And f after Dana Hills, I went on and I cheered for the San Diego Chargers for five years. Um, being on the sideline of an NFL game is probably one of the most amazing experiences in the entire world. You don't really realize how crazy the act on field action is mm -hmm. until you're there. But um, yeah, I, I completely enjoyed it. I loved it. Um, I was involved with a lot of tutoring, especially of our some of our athletes when I went to San Diego State. Um, so I, I kind of understand where these boys are coming from. I know how much hard work and how much dedication it takes for them and to do what they do. And I, I know that they're hard workers and I know that they have it in them to get all of these amazing things accomplished. It's just figuring out their schedule and figuring out what works for each one of them individually. Mm -hmm. Great. Great, thank you so much.